The majority of people who become billionaires are well past their formative years. In this video, let's explore the youngest billionaires ever living in the world of luxury, lavishness, and riches. Number 10. Alexandra Anderson Johan H. Anderson, a Norwegian entrepreneur, has a younger daughter named Alexandra Anderson. Alexandra and her sister Katharina were left with his third investment holding after he took a well-deserved retirement. The company has a sizable investment portfolio in both private and public Norwegian firms, as well as over 70,000 square meters of real estate. Alexandra, on the other hand, is not one to live in her father's shadow. She is an accomplished horsewoman who has won numerous awards in various horse dressage contests. Alexandra was able to focus on rearing noble creatures and indulge her adventurous inclination thanks to her father's money. The 24-year-old Norwegian who became a billionaire at the age of 19 is far from a wasteful spender. She drives a used automobile and values the money her father has amassed. Number 9. Katharina Anderson the Anderson sister's oldest sister, who is also the heir to Johan H. Anderson's third holding, is not your ordinary billionaire. Despite the fact that she controls 42.2% of one of Norway's largest firms, she continues to live in her small cottage dorm room even after her father signed off on his large inheritance to her. She has a love for fashionable accessories, particularly purses and shoes. She even admitted to being a shoe addict, which is a far cry from Charlie Sheen's vices. If I had 1.3 billion when I was 24, I'd buy something much more substantial than a fancy Louis Vuitton bag. Katharina is also the Anderson family's troublemaker. Her license was suspended for 13 months after she was caught driving while inebriated in 2017. She was also sentenced to 18 days in prison and was required to pay a fine of $34,000. However, it appears that she has learned her lesson and has avoided problems ever since. Number 8. Andy Fang Andy Fang is one of the list's most mysterious billionaires. His personal life is unknown, but he frequently speaks at conferences, TED speeches, and other entrepreneurial events. And his insight into business creation is incredibly motivating. With the support of Stanley Tang, Fang was able to break into the Billionaires Club. Together, they founded the food delivery company DoorDash, which was valued at $4.7 billion in 2020. However, the corporation controls over 60% of the U.S. meal delivery market, indicating that it has a lot more potential. Andy Fang is an entrepreneur who feels that now is not the time to spend his hard-earned money, but rather to reinvest it in investments and funds. Number 7. Wang Zelong it takes a certain kind of person to become a billionaire at the age of 25. Furthermore, being in China makes it much more fantastic. CNNC, Huayuan Titanium Dioxide Company, was valued around $1.3 billion when he inherited it. CNNC is one of the world's largest suppliers of titanium dioxide, which is used to make pigments for coating plastic ink and other materials. While Tselong hasn't provided access to his flat for photo shoots, it's reported that he lives in a lavish mansion that contrasts sharply with his socialist ideals. That's probably why he doesn't show off his cash. Number 6. Austin Russell Austin followed in the footsteps of self-made billionaires Bill Gates and Mark Zuckerberg, dropping out of Stanford University to pursue his passion. Fortunately, Austin's dream paid off handsomely, and at the age of 26, he is the world's youngest self-made billionaire. Russell is currently worth around $1.6 billion as the founder and CEO of Luminar. The high-tech firm is working on autonomous vehicle development. While the autopilot is the source of his income, his life is anything but. Many people believe the young millionaire to be Musk 2.0 because his technological brilliance and AI flair have allowed him to become not only the youngest, but also the wealthiest billionaire. Russell now owns a third of Luminar, which has a net worth of more than $5.1 billion. The company and its creator are on the right track, as Toyota and Volvo rely heavily on their product to produce high-quality self-driving vehicles. Number 5. Jonathan Kwok Jonathan Kwok is the late Walter Kwok's youngest son. Walter was the chairman of Hong Kong's largest development business 
with a net worth of over $16 billion before his death. His two sons Jonathan and Jeffrey took over the family business after he died in 2018. Jonathan is now worth $2.2 billion, despite the fact that he is only 29 years old. He is one of Asia's youngest billionaires and his firm, Sun Hong Kai Properties, has an estimated net value of over $33 billion, making it the world's second most valuable real estate corporation. Like his father, Jonathan is all work and no play. Jonathan would not be seen flashing his fortune and purchasing ultra-expensive residences or cars. Instead, he is reinvesting in his future. In less than a year, his company will open the doors to a new ultra-luxury hotel in Hong Kong. Number 4. Stanley Tang Stanley Tang is Andy Fang's DoorDash partner and one of his generation's most creative minds. Stanley is a product of his generation as his $2.2 billion fortune would not have been conceivable without the internet. He is also one of the few who can thank the pandemic for giving DoorDash the boost it needed to become one of the country's most successful businesses. During the lockdowns, the app's popularity increased and it is claimed that 60% of all takeout orders in the US were placed through DoorDash. Since he was a small child in Hong Kong, Stanley has tried to create a successful business. However, it was his computer science degree from Stanford University that gave him the upper hand. Despite the fact that he's only 29, the young billionaire is a frequent visitor at entrepreneurial events and has given one particularly well-known talk at Imagine Talks. Tang loves to keep his private life discreet and avoids making large expenditures. Stanley, on the other hand, enjoys playing poker with his buddies as well as in tournaments. In August 2021, he became famous among poker aficionados after making an incredible bluff in a high-stakes poker game, which he went all in with nearly nothing. Number 3. Kevin David Lehmann Kevin David Lehmann is a third-generation German entrepreneur who, at the age of 18, inherited half of his father's massive enterprise. A year later, the young German has amassed a fortune of $2.5 billion and is the CEO of DM, a major international drugstore chain. This huge business employs over 60,000 people and has over 3,700 outlets in 12 countries. The company's worth is estimated to be approximately $12 billion. Kevin keeps his personal life quiet, yet there are several rumors regarding how he spends his days. One interesting detail is that, unlike other teenagers, Lehman does not like to sleep in and instead gets up around 5.30 a.m. every day. He enjoys reading, jogging, and most importantly, playing soccer with his friends. After all, he's a German kid who grew up playing soccer. Number 2. Gustav Magnar Witso Gustav is another young Norwegian billionaire. Norway appears to have a knack for turning young people into billionaires. Who knows, maybe it's something in the chilly air coupled with Viking bloodlines. Witso, who is 29 years old, inherited his large money from his father. He holds a considerable stake in Salmar ASA, the world's largest salmon farming enterprise. Gustav's father, also named Gustav, gave him half of the billion dollar corporation when he was 26, making him instantly $3.2 billion wealthier. In just three years, the young entrepreneur has increased his net worth by $2 billion, bringing his total to $5.2 billion. He accomplished this by wisely investing in a variety of tech businesses. Gustav is also not one to be shy in front of the camera. He is a professional model who is signed by some of Norway's finest modeling agencies, allowing him to go to exotic locations such as Dubai, Switzerland, and the Caribbean. He could easily pay for the excursions himself. But why should he when someone else is willing to pay? Unlike most of the other entrepreneurs on this list, Witso isn't afraid to flaunt his wealth, frequently posting photos from lavish locations across the world, own numerous high-end automobiles, and dress to the nines in designer attire. Number 1. Sam Bankman-Fried Sam Bankman-Fried is the world's wealthiest young man. In little more than four years, he went from zero to billionaire. Thanks to his Bitcoin investments and his studies on cryptocurrency exchange platforms FTX and Almeida, 
Because he was born on the Stanford University campus and eventually graduated from MIT, Freed was always surrounded by intelligent people. Despite having amassed an incredible amount of wealth in a short period of time, Bankman Freed still has a roommate. Unlike other billionaires who typically wear high-end suits and fancy clothing, this young genius is frequently seen in a t-shirt and droopy pants. This is due to his effective altruism ideology, which states that a person should make as much money as possible in order to have the most positive impact on society. He became Joe Biden's greatest fundraiser in 2020, donating $5 million to a pro-Biden super PAC. The young billionaire has worked extremely hard to reach this point. He rarely leaves the office and sleeps on beanbags most of the time. Bankman Free confesses that he only quits the office after his co-workers have had enough of him. So, when you were 26, how much money did you have? Let us know in the comments below. If you liked and enjoyed this video, don't forget to hit the like button and subscribe to the channel. For more insightful videos, get notified by clicking the bell button below. From the high-end stories of today, this has been Modern Luxury. As always, we look forward to seeing you again in one of our videos. Thanks for watching.